about American integrity. David Aerial Bridge is starting to up now for you, Ken. Okay, thank you. What's uh what's the current there? I can't see the light. Uh right now we've got a neutral current, Ken. Excellent. Good afternoon, visitors. Right now we have the American Integrity arriving from the Duluth Ship Canal. American Integrity was built as a Lewis Wilson employee in 1978 by the Bay Shipbuilding Company of Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin. She measures 1,000 feet in length, 105 feet in width, and 46 feet in depth. She is powered by 3,500 horsepower, 20-cylinder General Motors diesel engines, which give her a top speed of 14 knots or about 16 miles per hour. She is also equipped with 1,500 horsepower bow and stern thrusters to aid her maneuverability and port. The American Integrity has 37 hatches on her deck, which open into seven cargo holds located below deck. Each hatch covering measures 56 by 11 feet in size and 5 tons in weight. She has a maximum carrying capacity of 78,900 tons. Above her deck is a 250-foot self-unloading broom, which allows her to unload her own cargo at a rate of 10,000 tons per hour without the aid of shoreside equipment. The American Integrity is owned and operated by the American Steamship Company in Williamsville, New York. The American Integrity has been owned by three different companies over the years. She sailed as a Lewis Willis employee under the Bethlehem Steel Corporation, the Ogilvy Norton under the Ogilvy Norton Company, and finally the American Integrity under the current ownership of American Steamship. She has broken several cargo records during her career for iron ore pellets, uh, which was about 75,000 tons in 2017, and they had a record load of limestone, about 52,700 tons loaded in 1992. She currently just hauls iron ore pellets for Western Coal, and she is one of 13,000 foot vessels that currently operates on the Great Lakes. Her owner, the American Seaship Company, is one of the largest American fleets on the Great Lakes. The company has a long history going back to its founding in Buffalo, New York in 1907. They currently operate 6,000 foot vessels on the lakes. The American Integrity is on its way in today to load uh, western coal or low sulfur coal at the Superior Midwest Energy Terminal on the Superior side of the harbor. Uh, it's one of our more common cargoes that we have leaving the port. It is mostly taken to uh, various power plants around the Great Lakes, specifically uh, DTE power plants in St. Clair and Monroe, Michigan. Uh, and the American Integrity will be taking their load uh, to St. Clair, I believe, um, and not uh, to also to Monroe. So once again, we have the American Integrity arriving to the Duluth Ship Canal. She's built in 1978, measures 1,000 feet in length, 105 feet in width, and 46 feet in depth. She has a maximum carrying capacity of 78,900 tons. Owned and operated by the American Steamship Company of Williamsville, New York. And she's currently on her way in today to load low sulfur coal at the Midwest Energy Coal Dock on the Superior side of the harbor. If you see any crew members on deck, make sure to give them a good wave and welcome them back to the Twin Ports. Thank you. 